Hello everyone, the weather forecast has promised us a very pleasant day for football and that's exactly what we've got. I'm Derek Ray, ready to bring you match commentary and alongside me is Stuart Robson and all about action from League One coming right up. It's Cambridge United and they face Milton Keynes Dons. Yes, thanks as always Derek, we've got two good teams here so I'm anticipating a really good game. The atmosphere is electric inside the stadium before kickoff, and hopefully we're not disappointed. This is how it looks for the home side. Well, in this shape, their two holding midfield players will be key today. If they can get on the ball and dictate the play, protect the two centre-backs, it will then allow the attacking players to show their creative quality. And a look at the starting 11 for MK Dons. Well, when you see it like that, their central midfield players look a little bit isolated. But I'm expecting the two fullbacks to push up to more of a 3 4 3. And I think we'll see a lot of positional rotation in this starting 11. And this confrontation is underway. Doing well to keep possession. Superbly read and executed. McEachran. And Isa on the ball. Mohamed Asa, well, flinging himself at it. Well, they're going for the short one. And he clears the danger. Not a chance for them again to play it over from the corner flag. Taken short. Decided to come in from the flag. That's a great stop. Well, his reflexes are so good there. That's a fantastic stop. Now, how about the short corner? And he could be in proper trouble here. Josh McEachran. Well, possibilities in the centre. And that's going to go all the way out of play. Disappointing. I'm trying to switch the play, but he overhit it. Houlihan. Possession changes hands, the interception there. And he read it well defensively. This is Jones. Adam May. He 
It's Smith. And back with Williams. Patient enough build-up. Can they carve out a chance? Well, it was a good-looking sequence, but it comes to an end. Mohamed Asa, chance to run at them. Over the touchline for a throw-in. A really single-minded piece of defending to make sure nothing untoward happened. And that's great work to keep it in play. Houlihan. Well, the stats don't lie. It's been very tense and an even battle so far, but neither side has played with enough quality to pose a real threat going forward, and that needs to change. And a chance to whip it in here. Fruitful looking attack. Very comfortable when in possession. Wes Houlihan. Cuts it back. Excellent assessment of the situation at the back. Counter attacking, very much an option. Space and time for the cross. Well, time just challenged magnificently. Now the electronic board showing one additional minute. Difficult to stop him. Adam May. Applying vigorous pressure. Chance to cross. Now well, the teams are locked together. Will it stay that way following this corner? Well, they've been frustrated for quite a while now, but these fans have suddenly come to life. Over it comes. Well, able to survive that attacking push. A chance then for the respective managers to address their charges. It is half-time here. The two teams have switched around and are ready now for the second half. Mohamed Asa. Josh McEachran. Well, lovely work to get past his man. Well, in the final analysis, it was good defending. Houlihan. May on the ball. Pass after pass, keeping their opponents moving. Adam May. Read it superbly to take back possession. And he did well to cut it out. Houlihan. Smith now. Adam May. Now, let's see what they can do here. Still on level terms, moving the ball nicely. But then the one that goes astray. McEachran. Superb defensive judgment to end the attack. Can he take advantage? 
Well, there's a keeper on song. Well, how did he stop that? That's just unbelievable. And with play stopped, they will make the change now. Who's going to get on the end of it? On a time for composure on the ball. Jones. Wes Houlihan. Houlihan. And they need to get tighter. And attempting the through ball. Oh, magnificent from the keeper. Fantastic stop. Opportunity in the wide area. This looks promising. And no way through. He takes aim. One block after another. The delivery. And he's clear as lines. Well, it's been a frustrating day for these fans. They want a goal. They're urging them to attack now. He went in so dangerously with that tackle. Now, the referee is the man everyone's looking at. Well, he's going to be taking no further part in this match. Well, it's not a clever challenge, is it? They're going to have to dig in now. Well, they've decided to make a change. And still on the lookout for the goal that could be so important at this juncture. Can they get in behind them? It's opening up for them. They're moving the ball impressively here. Oh, they've done it! They forged ahead, and it might be the goal that gives them victory. Yeah, here's the setup play. Well, it's a great little back heel, isn't it? And then the shot is emphatic. He strikes it with such power, the keeper has no time to react. What a good finish. a big moment in the dying embers will it prove decisive here five minutes to go McEachran they've got to be really mindful of the time situation attacking though they might be Josh McEachran And options in the centre. Josh McEachran. Can he finish this? Reading it well. well. Mopping up defensively. Oh, moving it nicely. And there goes the final whistle. And the home fans are going to be happy about this outcome. Yes, Derek. Well, it could have gone either way, couldn't it? It was so competitive for much of the game, but they kept pushing, kept believing, and probably deserved the winner in the end. A great result. But it just seems in this game, he's been a step ahead of his opponents in every way, Stuart. Well, I enjoyed watching him today. His work rate, skill, and movement were excellent, and he fully deserved to score that winning goal.